Idre Prime and Mesa Prime is now over. That means it's time for Volt and Loki. So they are here available and I know everyone is going to aim for the inflated Loki because Loki is now a Warframe that everyone is going to want and get from these accessories. So you are able to get these two Warframes with also the accessories as well. You also get Worm Prime from Loki as well, which Worm Prime is a Sentinel. So uh, I don't know if everybody likes this one, but definitely pick this one up actually because this has the Prime Laser Rifle. Which you can also use the original rifle as well for the worm. So, but I think everybody likes Prime version, so why not just pick up the Prime? Because Zaru Prime Sugatra that came with Vault is a Sugatra, so you're able to purchase that for one right guy, Aya. Then, Edo Prime Armor Set is back again, which came with Nova and is now returned with Vault. So, you're able to pick these two sets up. I'm oh, sorry, these sets up for two Riga Aya. Then you have the Damien Damon Prime Sugatra, which is one Riga Aya. And it's a really good one. I actually like using this one. It looks just the same as the Misa Prime Cyandana, which is also going to be returning soon. Then Summus Prime Sentinel Accessories, which also came with Loki. And yeah, the mask, the tail, and the wings are available. So, not bad. Bo Prime is also here as well. Oranata Prime as well. This is the Arch Wings. Like I said before, Edo Prime armor sets are now available again. So, if you haven't got the chance to pick them up from Nova Prime when she was available, you can now pick it up again because Vault is here with the same accessories. So, here it is. The Edo Prime armor sets. They look really amazing. And you get to pick them up a second time if you are, have not been able to. They look really good. I think a lot of people like this accessories. Especially the... I like the shoulder plates. They really stand out the most when it comes down to using these accessories. The leg plates are actually pretty dope as well. Um, the chest plate is somewhat nice. And it has a, like a little electricity thing every time you roll. So once every time you roll... It goes into it like has this little a little electricity magnet kind of around it and it looks pretty nice I mean once you start using it you'll obviously notice what I'm talking about but yeah it actually looks really nice and I think these accessories are pretty good as well so if you're definitely thinking I'm picking this up I would say pick up these armor sets and I'm not really a fan of Sugatras but this is also came with vault prime the Kazuru Prime Sugatra. I mean, it is a pretty nice looking Sugatra, which, okay, that's pretty annoying how you're holding it like that, my man. <laughs> but looking at this, it's not so bad. It doesn't, uh, well, it does have electricity on it. I was going to say it doesn't, but it's small. So it's pretty nice looking Sugatra, but I like Damon better. So, yeah, it just... It's not really all that worth it to me. But if you guys like Sugatras, then I would say you can pick up this one. It only costs one Rigaea, so it's not a bad purchase. But it's always up to you guys whether you purchase it or not. So like I said again, Damon Prime Sugatra is here. And one of my favorite Sugatras to ever wear on any of my... Or put on any of my weapons, basically, as a little tassel hanging down from my weapon and I really like these Sugatras again they look like Misa Prime Cyandana so yeah I think that's why I like it so much it just really stands out especially when you put it on in one of your weapons and yeah I just like how they look they look really nice and the colors just really just pop out on the uh, Sugatra so overall I would say if you want to really aim at a Sugatra pick this one Pick this one up before it all ends and goes away. So, yeah. If you're thinking about picking up a Sugatra, I think I would say this one. Alright. One of the best Sugatras, I would say, out of all Sugatras, Damon is the one. Then you have your armor sets for the Worm, which you can put on any other, I would say, uh, you know, Sentinel you can. But these armor sets are not so bad. 
but I wouldn't say they're too good. The wings are just a little off. Honestly, it doesn't really fit on any other Sentinel besides the worm, all right? And that's what it was basically meant for. But honestly, I only use the front mask and sometimes the back of the tail. Not any of the wings because they just look pretty off. And like I said, they don't really look so good on any other um, Sentinel. But it's not such a bad accessories. But would I say it's worth it right now? No. Not ever. I would say pick this up when this all prime resurgence goes away and yeah you guys get another chance of purchasing prime accessories back to normal of how it used to be but hopefully they don't actually have this around every year or something you know so hopefully digital stream doesn't make this an everything thing so again Edo prime armor sets i would say aim for and if you love sugatras damon Prime Sugacho is one Sugacho I would say aim for. The rest is always up to you, but I would say those two main things that I just said are worth it. But that is up to you guys. Let me know in the comments below what you think about these accessories and if you think they're worth it. But that is all for this video. If you guys did enjoy it, make sure you leave a like and subscribe if you're new to the channel. Follow me on all social medias and Twitch. Links are in the description. Thank you so much for watching. Love you guys, and I'll see you in the next video.